Hey everybody, I'm Chris with 1441 Engraving. I figured I'd do a quick video on um, what I'm doing today, which is just engraving some Zippo lighters. So I got some Zippos. Hopefully the, hopefully it's not backwards, but anyways, nice brushed chrome. Um, or not brushed chrome, sorry, shiny chrome um, lighter. So I'll bring you over here to my work area. So I've got a jig made, uh, which was nicely made by l and Precision out of, uh, I believe he's, I don't know, out of Texas. I don't know where he's at. Mike, forgive me. Anyways, uh, so because it's so shiny, the laser bounces off of it and I can't see. So I'm going to put a little tip for you laser engravers out there. I'm going to put some uh, dry erase marker so that I can see what the heck I'm doing and line it up correctly. And center it and so forth and there you go other thing I need to do is focus so I'm gonna focus this thing correctly which is right about there and uh, now I'm gonna come over here do some work on the computer here I'm gonna try to line it up I guess we'll go back here so you can see what I'm doing. Ah, uh, boy. There we go. Okay. So, I'm just going to try to get that in the center. Also, um, sized correctly. It's a little big. So. There we go. Looks like a pretty good size for it. Again, I'm just trying to center the graphic on the lower part of the Zippo. And that's a good, good, good position. Now I come over here, since I've got that sized correctly, I'm gonna make a couple copies and bring them over to the, where the other, where the other uh, Zippos are. So I've got three, made three copies. Try to bring that see that graphics not really centered so we'll keep bringing it down bringing it down and it's going too slow for me so I'm gonna drag it down there we go all right center that sucker up Looks like it's in the center there. Now we'll do the other one. This one over here. Obviously it's a little too high on the on that lower section, so we'll bring it down a little bit. Right there looks good. Now we gotta center it. like it's about centered there all right now we'll come back up here we've got some initials here that we need to uh, get correct so what I'm gonna do is size it in the top section over here and uh, it's a pretty good let's see what they look like I can actually show the letters themselves and that's a pretty good size. So now I make it a box instead of the letters. So now it's just easier to center up and, uh, well, center up. That looks pretty darn good right there. So come back here. We'll make two more copies of the letters. And again, Drag them over, come back here, see if we can't line that up in the center. That looks like a good position there. All right, we'll go to the other set. That's a little off, so mess with that a little bit. That's the beauty about these lasers, fiber lasers are, um, you know, you've got the 
the red light kind of showing you exactly where that laser is going to cut. And uh, it's a great, great tool. All right. So we are, we are all set. So I'm going to bunch these together, make it so that I can engrave correctly. And I'm going to set this for four times and we'll see how they do. All right. So I've got my fume extractor here, which I'm going to turn on. I'm going to turn the laser on so you're going to hear that. And now I'm going to turn this fume extractor on, which is going to get pretty loud. So here we go. And then I'll engrave. Laser's off, fume extractor's off. Uh, it looks really good. Just gonna kind of, yeah, that's that's in there. All right, well, let's see what they look like. Take one out and uh, wipe all this stuff off. And there you have it. Looks good. So now that we got it. All nice and shiny, all the fingerprints off. I'm gonna put it back in our box. It's a good presentation box, right? Cover on. C for chrome. And it's ready to give it to the client. So, hey guys, thanks for watching this video. Uh, if you have any questions, comment below. I'll try to answer as many as I can. Um, just click subscribe and um, I appreciate it. All right, guys, take care.